Watch the pace for everybody around you. Here we go, guys. Here we go, guys. Hey, Terry, how we doing? How's it going? Haven't Great. seen you since you shooed me away from that TV spot. Oh, I know. They get I, hit on us so bad for I that. I couldn't believe that, man. So you did the, you did the Kansas City Cleveland game? No, no, no. Oh, Tennessee. Tennessee. No, we're not going to Cleveland. <laughs> wow. Who were the guys that got thrown at last year? Remember all wow. those? Oh, God. If you guys have been there on this one, wow. <laughs> Four wideouts, draw play to Pittman, trying to get wide, 25, cuts it in, 20. He's all the way down to the Ravens' 18-yard line. God, we're just yelling it! Draw, Shannon! Out of the hole to two for the punter. Snap back, Gramatica, plenty of foot, and it's good. All right, all right, D, all right, all right. You gave a little, but you held him to three now. You just gotta give, can't give up the big plays. Can't give up the big plays. Come on, attack it, attack it! Second and seven from the 37. Jamal Lewis alone set back. And a tight end. Redmond back to throw, short drop. Out into the flat and nearly picked off. Oh, Chris, it's two. Chris. Off the shoulder of Redmond. Redmond in the pocket. Little screen pass, and that was almost picked off. Oh. Find right. your tight end. Right, they gave you the front. You knew it was two. Yeah, did you know it was two? Yeah, I know it's true. Well, then you got to go to your tight ends right now. No, go to the tight ends right now. Snap back. Zastadil high punt, not a bad punt. Williams backs up, takes it on his own 44. Get there, get there, JR! Get Comes there, to the near side, a Raven misses. Now runs up the middle, he's up near midfield. Now turns the corner, 45-40. Only Zastadil back there. He's down the far sidelines. God, he had him. And he is gone. Touchdown, Carl Williams. Brings it back, 56 yards. Big special teams play. All right, here we go, here we go. You gotta respond. You gotta respond. Damn it, he can't hit and wrap up. Come on, man. Come on, man, two touchdowns. Who's gonna keep fighting? Who's gonna keep fighting? Shotgun, Redmond with the football. Throwing deep upfield for Stokely. Have double coverage incomplete. Just guessing, throwing it up. They pressed up man for man, had everybody there right from the get-go. Just try to see it now, like on that play pass, right? You're, 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 you're kind of deciding ahead of time yeah, what, what you're doing rather than just looking at the coverage and knowing where that play is going to be open right. based on the coverage that you see. There's no specific answer. We're just kicking our ass. So, so stay with the calls that we've got on here. Mix it up between your regular dot, weak side run, throw back in your new stuff. We, we said it would be tough sledding. The problem is that they march down the field, they kick a field goal, and, and now we're behind the eight ball because we feel like we've got to do more. We don't know that these runs at a wing don't work. is coming. Third down. Redmond back to throw. Throws over the middle. It's deflected and intercepted. And off to the races is Derek Brooks. He's going to go all the way unless somebody can run him down. Brooks is gone. 98 yards. That is the, uh, the salt in the wound. Okay, we got uh, some giants to slay based on what I talked about last night. And like I told you, it has nothing to do with Tampa Bay Buccaneers. They, the handle is pretty good, plain and simple. But the Giants we got to slay are the ones within ourselves now as to, to how we improve and go forward and learn from what you learn from today. It always stings like it when you lose, always. And don't ever, nor will we ever, become complacent about it or accept it. Uh, now, that doesn't mean you, you, you break chalkboards and throw around and kick chairs. I'm not talking about that, trying to show you that you're trying to show the outside world that you're upset about losing. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about being a professional and finding a way to focus when everything around you starts fraying a little bit. Newspaper articles, people chipping away on the radio, friends and family wondering why this, wondering why that. How come you're not playing more? How come they're not doing this? How come they're not blitzing more? How come they're not zoning more? How come they're not running more? How come they're not passing more? and not give in to all that peripheral stuff. Keep your focus about being a professional and get better with every, with every phase.